Presets are a great way for creating a set of images with a cohesive look. Creating your own preset is even better because that way you create your own look and give it a personal touch. Up here we have the temperature and I tend to make the colors warmer. So I'll be pushing the temperature towards warmer. A good orientation here is that 6,500 Kelvin is for daily light. So that's also where I will be having the temperature for this one. Next up, I think with the exposure, we're totally fine. I'm just gonna lower the contrast a little uh, because we do have some very bright highlights and some very dark shadows. So I'm gonna lower the contrast here. And then especially the highlights, I'm gonna lower these. And that way you can see that we get the blue from the sky back, which is really nice. And then with the shadows, I'm going up to get more texture of the building. The whites also, I'm gonna lower these. And then the black. My favorite part is the HSL panel. So we will be mainly focusing on that because that's where you can adjust each of the colors in the image. So we're gonna choose hue here. And then you can manipulate the color here. So we're gonna go a little bit more to yellow here and orange. What I like to do with the color of the sky is usually have that one a little bit further towards cyan. Once all of this is done, I go back up and check if everything is leveled the way I like it. So now what we've done here is we created a look, but as I didn't go too wild with the colors and the adjustments, what you can now do is just easily make that a preset and apply that to all the images, for example, that in that case I took in Madrid, but you can just do it with the place you're photographing or the subject you're photographing. And to create the preset, you go to the left panel, you click on the plus button for presets, you choose create preset, and then name the preset I'm just gonna name that one Madrid, Julia. And here in the settings, you can choose if you wanna have all uh, the adjustments checked, or you can also uncheck some of the adjustments if you don't wanna have all the settings that you did in the preset itself. And that's how we have our preset. If you would like to see more videos like this one, feel free to subscribe to Domestica. And if you want to learn more about lifestyle photography, feel free to check out my course on Domestica.